Hi, and welcome to this video on how to use mynextmove.org. So My Next Move is fueled by both ONET Online, which we've already seen, and the Bureau of Labor Statistics Occupational Outlook Handbook, or OOH. So you can see ONET here, and then it's pulling data um, from OOH. So it's um, definitely up to date and so on and so forth, as, as are the other two sites. So a little bit more about this. Um, there are many things you can do. You can search uh, an occupation by a keyword. So like you could put electrician in, you could browse careers by industry. So you can see what some jobs are within any of these industries. Um, but also you can do the interest profiler right here under discover your interests. So um, if you know what you wanna do, so I want to be a, and then you can fill in the blank. I'll know when I see it. You can try this one, or I'm not really sure. Discover your interests. And before I forget, um, there is a My Next Move for Veterans. So if that happens to be you uh, or someone you're trying to help with career stuff, this is a great place to go. You can um, put in your MOS, your military occupational specialty, or whatever you did there, and find what they call crosswalks um, to civilian careers. Um, if one of these three options or the My Next Move for Veterans doesn't seem to work for you, um, you could look at Bright Outlook Careers. Those are the um, careers where the number of jobs available is growing. Career clusters, which is kind of like industries, um, career sorted by interest or job preparation. So let me just show you what something like this looks like. So let me put in electrician, it's something will self-populate. I'm going to put that here. Um, it's going to tell you what some other um, titles might be, uh, what they do, what on the job. There, These are some tasks, knowledge, skills, and ability, these short lists that are a bit easier to read, um, education needed, fine training, licenses, oppression, uh, sorry, apprenticeships, certifications, et cetera. And then... Um, you can look at the job outlook and the, the salaries. You can further dial it down into state and local salary info. And then it also directs you to ONET online for more information, more in-depth text about electricians and what they do. Um, and then on the ex explore more, there's different kinds of um, jobs that are related. And then the overall industry would be construction. So I'm just gonna go back here and I'm gonna select, um, I'm gonna select uh, transportation since that's one of our industries we look at. And then here you can go ahead and look in to any one of these that come up. And remember when you see this sun, that's bright outlook, jobs are growing in that sector. And then if you were to click into any one of these, you're gonna get that same kind of setup that you saw when we did electrician except for this one is for aircraft cargo and handling supervisors. So if we go back here, um, discover your interests. Again, this starts that ONET interest profiler assessment. So if you haven't done that already, you might wanna give that a shot. Um, there is also a help section, explore section, and a career section you could look into. There's an apprenticeship job finder section. Um, so lots of good stuff going on there. Not as much information on here as there is in the Occupational Outlook Handbook or ONET, but it can be an easier place to start if you don't want to get overwhelmed. So that's my next move. Thanks so much.